Hey, hey guys, we're going to do a wash day with Grace's Natural Products. But before we start, let's do this. Yeah, alrighty, righty, righty then. So before we start any kind of washing, um, if you watched the video prior, that I posted prior to this, I actually did the hair mask by Grace's as well. And I left that on for 24 hours. And then this is the next day as I'm washing it out uh, for the wash day. Before I start, I'm actually going to use my detangling brush. It's called the Zara detangling brush from Tame Bella. The neat thing is she has different um, detangling brushes based on the curl pattern of your hair, which is really, really great. A lot of times it's just one generic um, detangling brush, but in her case, she has made it specific to the actual curl pattern that you have, um, whether it's 4B, 4A, 4C, whatever it is, or or in the threes. And ours is in the, in the four, so we have obviously the Zara. Love, love, love. And I'm detangling the ends to help later on, as you can, as you will see when I detangle with her comb, it's just going to make it so much more simpler for me to detangle her hair. So now I'm actually washing out the hair mask by Grace's. This I really love this mask on her hair. Um, this is like I said, I let it sit overnight. Not probably not even quite 24 hours because I put it on before bedtime. And this is now the next morning that I'm washing it out. But her hair, as you can see, look how shiny her hair is. It really is moisturized her hair. It left it so silky, so smooth. I really, really like this mask on her hair. So I'm going to go ahead and use the scalp massager that I used in the prior video as well. Um, now that I have washed out the hair mask and right before I do any kind of shampooing, I'm going to go ahead and get those follicles ready, get them loose, um, get them stimulating. So for the wash, um, and it, and I, I like to do this for me. Some people do it during the um wash day i'm sorry the actual wash some people actually do it during the conditioner so it's just to easter on sometimes i do it um at different times as well so we're going to go ahead and lather up with our grace's natural products shampoo really 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 like this shampoo as you can see i went ahead and put a a, a small amount on my hand the first time but look how much um soap was in her hair just from that one time um i went ahead and put another just for the back because her hair is thick and just make sure i get the back and make sure i get the middle but as you can see that one use went a long way for someone like me who has shorter hair someone like my mom who has thinner hair that would have been more than enough for them um for their hair to use so you will actually the shampoo should actually last someone quite a while because you don't have to use so much of it and it is a thicker um texture and i really really like that as well but i'm but i only wash one time the more you wash it it tends to strip the moisture out of your hair well at least for my hair and her hair so i really do one one good wash which is another reason why i like to go ahead and use a scalp massager because that helps also get the any kind of product build up off of her scalp so therefore i can only, I only have to wash once so now we're going to use the conditioner and these ingredients right here that i'm showing you are all you you always want to look at any any products that you buy and make sure they don't have any kind of sulfate in them at all that can really damage the hair it can dry it out and we do not want that especially for curls you don't want any kind of curls to be dried out it is very damaging makes split ends and things of that nature Again, just like the shampoo, it is thick. I really like that. Um, and of course, you know, as naturals, we use a lot of conditioner. I know that I do, especially when it's um, her hair is as thick as Adara's. So um, crazy enough, I still have quite a bit of conditioner left, even though it looks like I'm using a lot because it is so thick. Um, it went a long way. So I just kind of parted it with my hands in different areas and just kept putting it in between. Therefore, I knew that it was getting all over her head. But again, I still have a lot of conditioner left in the bottle because it is so thick. So this wash day conditioner and um, shampoo actually should last someone quite a while, um, which is, all, this is always a great thing. No one wants to continue to have 
have to buy products in short periods of time especially if you wash once a week like or maybe like us every other every other week or sometimes twice a month it just depends um on how she does or what she did what kind of activity she did but like i said if you're one of those people that wash once a week then you know if it's a product that you're having to use a lot of that's not fun you're having to replace it often which can be costly so as you can see the conditioner is sitting on her hair i'm just taking my detangling comb and it is going through so easily as you can see um, detangling the ends at the beginning helped a lot as you can see i'm not receiving hardly any shedding whatsoever which is also a great sign of health and don't get me wrong, you are going to shed hair. That is normal, but you should not be shedding lots and lots of hair. Um, we hardly, uh, Dara's hair hardly um, sheds at all. But again, her hair is virgin compared to mine. Um, I dye my hair often. So um, yeah, my hair is a little different. It's definitely not virgin anymore um, due to the, the dyeing. But um, I, I really like the fact that her hair barely shed it. And as you can see, from this wash day, her hair is shiny, and I wish you could feel it because it's a super, super soft, very soft. I really, really like that. And um, very, you know what I liked about it is her scalp was super clean. Like, I'm trying to let you see this a little bit of there, but her scalp was very, very clean, and I like that. So we are going to go ahead and do just a quick Afro puff. We're going to get rough and tough with our Afro puffs. Yes, I'm showing my age at this point. So I'm going to use um, the products by Grace's, which is the flaxseed gel and the aloe vera gel mixed together that she's made. Um, I feel like she made that just for me because everybody knows that I really like these two products. So um, these two products and her hair butter. I'm going to just show you just um, take some back of her hair and show you what the products will do to her hair once I add them. I don't want to um, add too much to her hair simply because it, as you can see, it does make it curly, but I want her Afro puffs to be big Afro puff. So I don't want it super, super curly. I want it more big than curly, more volume. So it, but it is giving me a lot of moisture, but I just wanted you guys to see what this products, both of these products do on her hair, which as you can see, look how shiny it is. It's, I mean, I'm able to detangle it with my fingers very easy. And I really like the hair butter as well. It's, it's thick, but it comes on very light. It's kind of odd. Um, the way it seems, but it actually works very well. Even though it's thick, it doesn't just weigh down her hair at all. It came on very light and I did not have to use a lot at all, which is always, again, a good thing. So with all of her products from Grace's, I foresee me um, not having to resupply this for quite a long time. And that is the, the moisturizing gel, which is the flaxseed and aloe vera, the hair butter, and then the wash day. I don't foresee me having to um, rebuy these products very often at all. But as you can see, and now that I've at the hair butter, just look at her hair. I really, really like these products on her hair. Um, and of course, I've already showed you guys what aloe vera and the flaxseed does to her hair anyway. So just imagine it being in one bottle, very convenient for you just to throw on her hair without having to cook it. So I am going to go ahead and detangle just to show you guys how soft and um, her hair is from the product and how easy it is to detangle her hair. Look at that. Just one, I mean, literally super easy. And again, not a lot of shedding at all. I don't know if her hair shedded at all um, in during this detangling process. But as you can see, uh, the curls are popping and the brush is just easily going through. I do like that detangling brush because as you can see what it does to the curls, like the, the products already curls it, but the detangling brush pops them even more. Really like that. I know a lot of people like the Denman brush for that reason as well, but this Zara brush does the same as you can see. I really, really like that about this brush, especially when you have good products on the hair. It comes off so easily and it pops the curls even more, especially when the products are great, like I said. So these are the products that I've been using um, 
right now on her hair really like them just going to just put a little bit over her entire hair just so we can go ahead and get our afro puffs rocking this is what she was rocking for her birthday just a cute afro puff look um i am going to use um what we call a puff cuff i don't know if anyone has seen a commercial for those um i know on instagram she runs a um, a constant uh, sponsoring commercial but i like the puff cuff because i don't have to use a rubber band or any type of um ponytail holder to make it tight so you literally just wrap it around and then you clip it on the end and boom voila there you go you have your ponytail they come in all different sizes very small medium and a large um so that's a good thing so when i'm i have all three sizes um so depending on how i wear her hair if i wear her hair in one big afro puff then i'll wear i'll do the medium size so it can fit a little bit um looser and not really, really tight but as you can see i'm just going to click it right there and then boom let it go and we're we're good we're ready to roll so that completes our full wash day and style with graces so hopefully you enjoyed this video. Please let us know what you think. Please hit that subscribe button and the like button. And go ahead and turn those notifications on. And we love the love and we give the love back.